Hey guys, it's Ryan. Welcome back to my channel. So today I obviously have a different type of look going on. I am filming my very first Halloween makeup tutorial. I really, really hope you guys enjoyed this video. It's very new to me and a little bit scary. I just wanted to do something different. I got inspired by the color gold and um, I got also got inspired by Tina Tutorials on Instagram and YouTube. She did something similar to this. She made hers a, a skull and I just decided to make it less uh, scully. <laughs> Um, but yeah, so be sure to check out her video. I'll have it linked down below and Yeah, if you guys enjoyed this video and you want to see more Halloween videos before Halloween um, Be sure to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already and let me know in the comments below I really hope you guys enjoy this video and let's just get into it So first I'm starting off with my primer as usual and then I'm just gonna take my LA girl pro concealer and carve out my brows I don't know why but when I saw this look in my head I pictured really thin eyebrows so I just put the concealer over top of like about half of my eyebrow just to make it really really thin when everything numbs, who needs cocaine freeze your brain so now I'm taking just a small little brush and I'm blending in the concealer and I'm going to use that as a primer as well all over my eyelid <laughs> and then I'm taking a beauty blender and just blending it all in. Next I'm going to just fill in my eyebrows as if my eyebrows are actually that thin but I'm going to drag the tail down to about like the end of my eye. Next I'm taking my shade and light eyeshadow palette and I'm going to take the light sh the two lightest shades and i'm just going to set the concealer so that i don't have any creases or anything in my eyes next i'm going to take my kai shadow palette and i'm going to take the two brown shades and i'm just going to use that as a transition shade all over my eye next i'm going to take the beauty killer palette by jeffree star and i'm going to take the gold shade and i'm just going to put that on my inner corners and like about halfway on my eye then next I'm going to take the shade and light palette again and take the black shade and do a really smoky eye so it can be really messy you just need to make sure that the eye is really black. <laughs> so next I'm just going to take my gold eyeliner from NYX and do a pretty dramatic wing. Then I'm going to take a glow kit or any type of highlighter that you have and highlight your brow bone to death. <laughs> Next, I'm going to take my Anastasia Beverly Hills Stick Foundation in the shade Earth, and I'm just going to apply that all over the face. So next, I'm going to be taking an e.l.f. eyeliner, like just a little gel eyeliner pot. We are not concealing today. We are just going to draw these like squiggly water lines i don't really know how to describe it but if you can see what i'm doing just try to follow that but we're gonna do it from the bottom of my eye like the lash line so next i'm taking the shade and light palette again and taking the black shade and just using that to smudge out the lines from the eyeliner to make it a little bit more messy so this next part you're gonna see me try a bunch of different things to see what works i was gonna edit it out but i figured like this is just what actually happened like i was using a q-tip to apply the glitter but it wasn't applying as opaque as i wanted it to so then i was like okay well i'll use my finger and eyeshadow and then my finger was too big and it was getting all over the place so basically just do what works and just try out different things I ended up using a q-tip to apply the eyeshadow in the teardrops and then I just decided to use the same q-tip and apply the glitter on top of the eyeshadow. Next I am taking my Lime Crime liquid lipstick in the shade Xenon, I think that's how you pronounce it and I'm applying that all over the lips. And next I'm taking this Ofra lipstick, I don't remember the shade but it's more of a copper and I just mixed the two together. Now I'm taking my glow kit and I'm putting it literally everywhere. I'm just using my setting spray, of course, and this is the final look. So I really hope you guys enjoyed this video today. I had a lot of fun filming it, and it was kind of scary, to be completely honest, because I've never done a Halloween video like this before, um, or a Halloween video ever. 
Uh, I really, really, really enjoyed creating this and just playing with what I had. If you do recreate it or you have other ideas for me, be sure to tag me um, in my Instagram. It's always linked down below. And if you want to see more videos like this, more Halloween videos, I was thinking about doing um, a Halloween look every day or every other day if I have the capacity to do so. And if you would like to see that, be sure to subscribe and give me a thumbs up. That would be really awesome. And yeah. All right. <laughs> I think that's it. And I'll see you guys in the next one. All right. Bye, guys.